everybody, welcome back to my channel. I'm Deborah, also known as Doobage42, and you have joined us for Tuesday Reviews. Now, it's been a while since I've done any kind of makeup review. Oh, before I forget and before you forget, click that like button while you're sitting here. Now, as far as makeup reviews goes, everybody knows I love makeup. I love to play with makeup. I like to try new things. And today I'm going to talk about some stuff that I've been using for a little while now, trying it out in all different ways and just seeing how it goes. It is makeup by a company called Carity, K-A-R-I-T-Y. And at first I was a little skeptical because their prices are so much lower than anything you'll find at Sephora or Ulta. But let me tell you, the quality really is there. Holy smokes. Let me show you what I bought so far from Carity. I did get two eyeshadow palettes. Yeah, <laughs> I got their matte palette and their frost palette and I have to show you what's inside these guys. Holy cannoli. I slid it out of its cardboard box and then you've got a huge palette. 21 matte colors and these are true mattes. They are also true to color, at least I've noticed they are. And I've been wearing them a lot because it is hard to find decent matte shadows out there. Now, you see all of these colors, like, whoa, there's a ton of them. Guess how much they were? You're probably guessing too much. This was $21. What? Seriously. And these are not teeny tiny pans either. These are huge. And look at these colors. Yes, they really are that vivid. Um, one of my favorites that I'm wearing right now is this Alexi. And it's sort of a purpley magenta color. Whoa. Let's do some swatch. That was just a light touch of it. It's beautiful. It goes on smooth. It blends nicely. I'm going to come in for a close up because that's most of what I'm wearing right now. Any non-matte you see actually came from the Frost palette. Yeah. These colors are amazing. It has forced me to try colors that I normally wouldn't wear. I actually did a look a couple of weeks ago that was using the uh, orangey color Vegas and the yellow one Tweety. Totally out of my comfort zone, but I kind of loved it, you know? And I keep wanting to try new things. I have been so pleased with this shadow palette. Let me show you the Frost one as well. Says on it, 21 highly pigmented shimmer eyeshadows. Now some are just shimmery, some are outright frosty. They are all beautiful. Here we go. Wow. Now notice there is no mirror. That's part of why you get it so much less expensive, but it is a nice sturdy palette with a magnetic closure. And I tend to keep the little plastic doohickey in there over them just to protect myself because I'm clumsy and drop things. But um, they arrived nicely packaged. I don't have the other packaging anymore because I have since thrown it away. Like I said, I've had these a while. But if you look closely, you can see that my favorite colors get used a lot. Bubbly, because hello, pink. You know, that's kind of me. And this overdose color has some nice chunky glittery bits in it. And there are some nice golden colors too. You can do warm, you can do cool, you can do neutrals. And it's a nice... Um, variety of colors and the quality really is top-notch it covers well it blends well you have to use a makeup remover to get them off because they do stay put I am pleasantly surprised definitely would buy some more of their eyeshadows again they've got some new palettes out that I have not managed to grab yet because hello budget the other thing that I've purchased from them so far is a highlight kit this is the first collection it's called. No, I'm not kidding. First collection. They have two or three, I think. Maybe even more. These are nice. They give you a nice variety of highlighty shades. Um, they do have some pretty good color to them. Let's show you. Let's go with nice clean finger. This one's called Risqué. It's kind of a champagne-y color. And you put it on, and you really can see the glow back from that. And that's, I think, the least glowy one. There's a Risqué, which is that champagne color. Desire, which is more of a rosy colored glow. Lacy, which is a lighter pink. And then Ravish, which is 
gorgeous. Now, I have a lot of highlighter. I should repeat that, a lot of highlighter. I started off with zero and then I kind of went on a highlighter buying frenzy. I've got a couple of Smashbox highlighters. I've got the Carity one. I've got a Becca highlighter. I've got Jeffree Star's highlighter, which the Skin Frost is still my favorite out of all of the highlighter formulas. But you know what? This is pretty freaking awesome. If you want a nice variety, grab their palette, one, either one, one or two, because you're gonna find some good quality stuff for a lot less expensive than the Sephora stuff and the Ulta stuff or even than Jeffree Star's. And I love Jeffree Star makeup, but yeah, pleasantly surprised. You know how I found these guys? On an Instagram ad. I know, right? You're supposed to like block all the ads, but I actually found something good. Check them out. I'm gonna leave the link down below um, to their site because if you're looking for good quality makeup that you maybe don't have to spend so much on, but you want variety, you want color, you want something that pops, you may wanna check them out. I haven't tried all their stuff yet, um, but you know, the year is young. <laughs> anyway, I hope you enjoy makeup, hope you enjoy the reviews, and uh, come back next time where who knows what I'll review. See ya.